Center for Coastal Management. Uh, Center for Coastal Management is one of the research centers of the <laughs> University of Cape Coast. And our main focus, or where we work, is along the coast and wetlands. Or is the English okay? If I'm My name is Philip Tamaklu. Uh, I'm a, a member of Avu, Avu Lagoon Crema and I'm a, a lead ranger. So what we do over here is we are protecting the resources of Avu Lagoon and luckily we are part of the Ramsar site area. So we used to protect the environment by cleaning up the, the area or, or the uh, water bodies that can be polluted. We are educating people not to be dumping rubbish and rubbish into the water or else we will lose our water bodies. And also we protect the animals that we have in the surrounding. Here we have sita, monkey and those kind of a species of birds. So our work is to educate people not to be killing them to promote ecotourism. Hello, my name is Joshua Adote. I am a research fellow at the Center for Coastal Management at the University of Cape Coast. And uh, Center for Coastal Management happens to be the lead implementing agency for the Avu Lagoon uh, protected area, uh, community protected area. And today we are here uh, together with the CRIMA um, board with support from the Forestry Commission and the Kagri Zoo to celebrate World Wetlands Day. And we are with the Tosuko DA Basic School, you know, to drive home the importance of uh, what these youngsters can do at their level to protect um, our wetlands. So it's nice to be here. We've had a great time, and we know that by this action, um, a lot of uh, efforts will be taken to protect uh, Avu Lagoon, which happens to be the home to Sitatunga. Uh, the, 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 the surviving population of Statunga in Ghana. This is the only place you can find Statunga in Ghana and it's good to be here to drive home some um, conservation um, actions or efforts in, in, in this regard. Thank you. Wisdom, Napoleon Agbanyahu, the headmaster of Tosuko D. Business School. Uh, I've been here for about seven years now and so far I realized that there's a whole lot of uh, uh, economic things going on here in connection with the lagoon and uh, it has brought so much economic activities to the people and they are also using it well uh, what we need to do is to take good care of it as we have been educated on it today the, the awareness has been on but today's one has been a special one so we want to encourage more of these visits so that we will be able to wake up more to the task and then Put things together to help the lagoon to, I mean, uh, put on its best clothes so that uh, globally others can also see it and then visit us. And as they come, we also uh, benefit by uh, seeing new faces, new uh, equipment, just like today. It's been a, a while now, my kids have never seen the drone before. Today they've seen it for the first time. So it came like a full trip lesson for us. It's one of the things we benefit from. We, we thank you for coming. Happy Wetlands Day! Happy Wetlands Day!